Good oh. morning, everyone. Good morning, Jamie. Good morning, Jesse. Morning. Good morning, smoothest operator on the interwebs on Saturday mornings, Baker. Good morning, and the loveliest eyelashes, Jamie. Yay. Yeah, and uh, the pre-workout is beginning to kick in because I haven't slept since yesterday almost, and I've been doing bad duty, so I thought it's a good idea to stream on some pre-workout. And now that the uh, allergen is really making my skin feel like I'm doing meth, <laughs> so, so if I turn all red, I might find some kettlebells and just do some curls in the background. But who doesn't need to do curls? Christine doesn't because she hits the gym regularly. Hey, Christine. Aww. Lefty, hey. he couldn't do a curl even if uh, he did it with air. <laughs> Captain Kern, <laughs> Deborah Kennedy, Maya I hope you had a nice morning with no work. Whisk I Iris and Danny T. Whiskey again. What is it? Late stipulated in a river. I'm not late. I was just about on time. I'm running on Jamie time. Anything within five hours of uh, the time you're told to start, it's uh, the right time. <laughs> <You're so laughs> Debbie Morin, how are you doing? Shizzy is an angel, but he's not wearing a halter top. But uh, but I am know. I am I am wearing suspenders. Well, actually, it's a it's a whole it's a whole thing here. So you know, I'm I'm not an engineer. I'm I actually do you know do work around the house. Surprising. Arrow. Okay, say, why do I go, I don't know, good morning, genitals. Sec, yeah, messed up. Du, du, du. Hello, Shuna. Hello, Nick. Remember, everyone, Jody Day is back today at noon. Good evening, Kim, or good night. It's late where you are. Lady Bloke. Stephen Farmer, you had set a goal for myself to try and not use your stabby stabby to pokey poke anyone. Well, it's a lofty goal, but hopefully uh, you will succeed. Hey, Scotty. Vinosaur, come on. Ah, go after my audio. What was what? Okay. You know what they say if you're not early, you're late. Yeah. And if you're not last, you're first. I don't know. <laughs> Thank you, Nick, for being a member for two months. And JD fan, how are you doing? Hey, hey Joe. I'm young. Yeah. And uh, funny enough, <clears throat> Jamie uh, called me into a meeting some weeks ago and said, I get it, fella. You want to use all this internet fame and glamour to pull in all the hotties, mm -hmm. all the mm -hmm. milfers. You uh, you want to use all your clout to pull some tail. But uh, I'm a woman of needs too. So uh, how about uh, putting uh, some wings, some, sun and some hot man meat? Yeah. And I said, Jamie, that's not why we had the ladies on it was because they are intelligent women with a lot of stuff on their mind and she said i still want some hot man meat and i said i'll do what i can jamie everything for you my dear and uh i put 
I put out the word, said, can we get the hottest person on the internet to join us? Can we get someone who's so hot, he has to have 24-hour air condition? Because Jamie will appreciate that. I'm still waiting for responses to that, but uh, <laughs> welcome, T-Rex. <laughs> 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 Wow. What's up, guys? How's How it going? Doing, brother? <laughs> Good morning, Spice. Thank you for being a member. All that jam. build up. And, and he I know, right? Perhaps you with the joke right at the end. <laughs> <laughs> I told you the pre work art is kicking in. Uh, it's firing on all. <laughs> Happy Saturday to you, too, Razor. Oh, yes. <laughs> Nice. That's what Baker does best. Yes. Yeah. He brings you in on a on a up on a up. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> you raise me up. <laughs> <laughs> <And the> mountain. <laughs> I love it. I love it when we get Jamie laughing. <laughs> yeah, we She's need a laugh. She really does. Is T Rex sitting at a table inside an RV camper? No, he's uh, sitting no. in, in his office. <laughs> I'm sitting at the steering wheel of my 18 wheeler. <laughs> Talking about someone that hauls ass. Oh. Yeah. Sometimes he drives around donkeys. Yes. <laughs> no, because Jamie uh, won't let me do it. She says, what? These are high class ladies. You don't treat them like uh, man meat. But the uh, men, yeah, whatever. I'm a fallen angel, but this is the only guy who gets hauled around with me. Oh, look at that cute puppy. <laughs> puppy. What a happy dog. What a happy dog. <laughs> He's a good boy. <laughs> what does Jamie with? beat you with when you don't want to stream? Is it purely physical abuse or verbal as well? Um, well that's a good question. I, I, uh, I want to know. Mostly, it's th through Twitter. She starts up saying, "Hey, chunk monster, what are you doing?" <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm at the gym. Hmm, funny. Didn't see any stream set up for today. No, there's nothing going on. <laughs> well, there's nothing going on but the rent, boy. Yeah, I, I know. So uh, why don't you uh, either hit the corner or start a stream? But Jamie, the last time you sent me to the corner, you know what happened. Yeah, but uh, do you want to happen? Did that happen again? Corner was no. Nope. That corner nope. was never the same after that. No, and uh, <laughs> so th that's that's how, and that's that's how my Sunday goes. She turns it up, and it's <laughs> Miss Christian the rest of the week. Miss Christian, oh, okay. Because yeah, I'll I'll send I'll send Jamie an invite, and she and she'll usually send a message back that says, "Listen, I've I I gotta I gotta get I gotta get my get my my hoe in order. Got got to put her to work. If I if if she ain't working, you know, then I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to put it hurting on him. I'm yeah. Like, well, I'm like J Jamie, Jamie, don't be so mean. Don't be so mean. And she's like, well, okay, I I. I'll tone it down just a little bit for you, Shizzy. Just a yeah. little bit. I, I'll only hit him twice. Mm. It, it's it, and it's only with something as big as your thumb, right? Rule of thumb, all that, no bigger. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but you always use a red hot poker, so it hurts extra. No, oh, Jamie yeah. is a sweetheart. I have to say <laughs> yes, that. Yes, like, gosh. Contractually applied <laughs> for that. I just um, remember to read that script she gave you. Um, yeah, it's really important. Blink twice if if you're if you're if you're you know if someone's in the room with you. <laughs> ha, ha ha ha! Insert name of person who asked. Ha ha ha! Brandon. <laughs> no, Jamie is the best person in the world. She is pure Midwestern. She is so nice that if you visit her at any time, she will let you in. And give you at least two chops of Aunt Jemima's butter with oh. leftovers. Oh. Aunt Jemima's butter. 
<laughs> if anyone, I didn't write that. If anyone <laughs> says anything else about Jamie, I get mad because Jamie is so nice. She absolutely don't make you uh, me say this. <laughs> I love Jamie. Everyone should say hail Jamie. Hail Jamie. Hail Jamie. Because Save the baker. Hail Jamie. Big Jamie is <clears throat> is sweet. Now send me the five hundred dollars, you idiot. Oh, don't read, don't read this. <laughs> Hail Jamie. You know, I wish I had that kind of power. Oh, wouldn't it be great? You just yeah. make him work all the time. <laughs> See, ch chat's along with us. Mm -hmm. Yes, hail Jamie. Jamie's not amused. <laughs> Jamie's always amused. She's yes. going to slap a bit after the show, but as long as the show is on, she'll smile. This is no. great, guys. Oh. Uh... This is great ammunition. Thank you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Keep talking. Keep talking. Yeah. <laughs> She's just sitting there thinking, oh, you're so cute when the camera's on. Aww. Aww. How's Jordan everyone special. doing? <laughs> <laughs> Let, let's go around the clock. Jamie, what have you been doing the last week? Watching a trial with you. Hmm. And getting uh, new uh, flashes. Well. Every couple of weeks, yeah. Yeah, but you got I them. got new nail polish from oh, Dollar nice. Tree. Neon pink. <laughs> I love when I turn it to girl stuff. He gets such a face. We wear pink no. On <laughs> no, it's it's fine. What uh, what have you been doing, Shiz Meister? Well, well, you know, I do I do the mor the morning streams, and then of course I do the the evening streams, and sometimes I jump on with MG and. And uh, stay up what much much later, and then and then of course I'm late for my morning streams and really worry everybody. Was that the <laughs> April Fool's joke that you were an hour late to your stream? Was it an April 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 Fool's Day? I don't remember. Time is <laughs> time is a social construct. I don't obey by abide by something like that. But no, uh, so I've been doing some uh, some of the what the hails on a Monday Tuesday, and then I do some of the. Uh, the other stuff that, that interests me, I'm working on doing edge comb and sort of getting caught up on the Sarah Boone stuff because that whenever that fires up, I plan on streaming those throughout the throughout the week or week and a half that it'll be going on. So well that's sort of have have they changed the plan? Because according to the plan, it should be starting the third of May. Who knows? Yeah. Who knows anymore? Uh, I just no, I know this is gonna be starting up. It could be fun uh, if you had a stream running uh, while, while we go to to uh, Tennessee, so I yeah. can call in and say good mornings. Hi. Yeah, we could we could have like the the morning stream. It'll just start off in the morning and won't stop until the end of the day. Yeah, until you have been on with LC the next morning. Oh God! <laughs> no! No! Uh, but yeah, so so I've been covering a little bit of that, plus uh, doing the edge comb, sort of a rewatch of that. And uh, Borowski, oh, he's so awesome. Um, but yeah, the Ivory Lamar is, is is an idiot. Yes, the biggest, the biggest idiot. And of course, like I have, I have Mo come on, you know, whenever she's able to. Um, and she's she's been she's been having a having a having a good time on those on those on those days that she comes on and you know she she makes sure to keep me a little bit in line just a little bit really well, no I, I i never noticed that yeah yeah she's she's pretty fun she's pretty no fun. I, I, I love her she's awesome oh, um nice. what about you what about what you, you t-rex how many states have uh, you been covering the last month a uh, week just let's go with me Most of the East Coast, I think Maryland, um, Pennsylvania, Ohio, Illinois, back down to Maryland, into Virginia, and now I'm going from Virginia all the way back to Illinois. <laughs> I was talking to a guy uh, today, 
I was at the vet, Veterans Union um, serving some beers, and uh, he just been to, I think, he st- say, started North Co- in North Carolina, went up and down again. Huh? And he told me he went through the Devil's Tale, the Devil's End. Somewhere. Oh, the Dragon's Tale? Oh, the uh, Dragon's uh, Tale. Yeah, okay, that's, a, like the, yeah. that's yeah, a great that's... motorcycle ride. Yeah, Love it that. is. Yeah. Yeah, that I've, I've I've ridden that before. Oh, I didn't know you rode motorcycle shit. Yes, yes. Oh. It's a little. It's you still a little have too, a bike. Yeah, it's it's just a little bit too chilly right now to be be uh you know throwing on the leathers and and uh, riding for you know multiple hours because it, it takes it takes me at least an hour and a half just to get to anywhere that's worth riding, and then mm-hmm. you're you're. You, you know, you got to remember that's another hour and a half back. So usually I just ride to where I want to ride and, and then just turn around and come back and never actually make the ride. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting too I mean, damn old for it. You gotta, I mean, like people don't realize that, you know, there's a 70 mile per hour wind chill. If it's below like, you know, 70 degrees, you just don't want to be on a bike. Not really. Yeah, usually, usually it's 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 below like sixty that it starts to starts to get really really bad for me. Other than that, I just throw on the leathers and I'm, I'm plenty warm. But uh, did you feel the earthquake? I did not. I might have been sleeping during it though. <laughs> That's funny. I'm pretty sure this guy uh, wasn't sleeping during it because he was in the middle of his vasectomy when the earthquake struck. <laughs> Oh no. That's awful. <laughs> uh no, don't go down any further. No. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know if it's pre or post up. Um <laughs> pre or post up. Uh, wow. <laughs> when one P- Pennsylvania man must uh, might have had the most memorable earthquake experience on morning of April fifth. Oof. He said on a post uh, on X, a effing earthquake happened in the middle of my vasectomy as of Friday afternoon. He post his post had fifty three k likes and six point two million views. Go follow me on X too and give me those numbers. He tells people that he was at the urology office at Hunting Hunting Dun Valley to have the procedure when the rare five point eight magnitude quake struck just before ten thirty. He recalls that everything started totally normal at the beginning of his 10 uh, 10 a.m. appointment and that his doctor walked him through each step of the procedure. And by the by the end of it, he well, she was doing much better. But (laughs) (laughs) Uh, we don't need to know what a vasectomy is. About midway through the surgery, the wall started shaking. Oh, yeah. (laughs) <laughs> I definitely assumed it was a train passing or something, not out of the ordinary for that office. But the surgeon kind of stopped for a second and said, that's that's got to be an earthquake, right? Uh-huh. Alan said that he still assumed what happened was a joke since earthquakes don't happen around here. However, based on the time it lasted and overall feeling, we all agreed it had to be one. We laughed because it was a situation none of us <laughs> would ever forget. <laughs> Being cut in the peen area, I'm not laughing. Well, doctor has 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 your balls literally in his hand and says, <laughs> that's got to be an earthquake. <laughs> Thanks, Doc. Oh, my God. <laughs> we all have a story to tell for years to come, he added. That the doctor momentarily put down his surgical tools and tend to shaking stuff. I was fully awake, just numbed, he said. <laughs> After he came out of surgery... Alan said he fired off his post, <laughs> thinking a few of my friends would f- find it funny and definitely ne- never anticipated it being as big as it was. I don't, no. I don't know. The way that they put that, I probably would have uh, changed the wording from fired off his post and uh, being as big as it was. I oh, they, they, they know what they're doing. That's uh, <laughs> they, they, they chose their phrasing on purpose. <laughs> His answer to the ju- to the judge uh, when he said, "Would you believe this was a four point eight? Should have said, but it was a cold in the surgery room. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> it was cold, Doc. It was cold. That's oh. a real earthquake. Yeah, it's. Uh, I'm not sure that's the day I want a, an earthquake to come by. No. Uh, just politicians whining. Doesn't matter. 
No, so uh, he he had a fun little snippety. <laughs> what I they don't tell you is fun. what. What they don't tell you is that what caused the earthquake. I can tell you because uh, <clears throat> I actually took geography. Oh, okay. If, if, Ready. This is the tectonic plates that uh, the Earth is made up. Here you have the Atlantic plate. This is, I think it's called the North American plate. The plate. Correct. This one, because uh, you have the Middle Atlantic Ridge. That's uh, a splitting zone. So it always moves this way. That's why Iceland gets so many uh, volcanoes, because Iceland is put up here. But because this one moves this way, it goes under the North American plates, which is on this route, if I remember my geography correctly. Yeah, they're just sort of... Yeah, and and let's do it in the opposite direction, because I know everyone is saying, yeah, it's, uh, it's Klaus Schwab who did it. No, because tectonic plates are very thick plates. And when they go together, as everything else in life, one must give. Just like when uh, Shizzy says to his wife, I don't want to do that. Two minutes later, he's just like this plate going down. Yep. And this plate is going up. That creates a tension zone. And every now and again, it says, <laughs> and release the and tension. That's why... That's why uh, California has so many, because they have two plates and a fault line. And <laughs> typical Americans, who do we give uh, the blame for it? The San Andreas fault? That poor Mexican did nothing wrong. Yeah. <laughs> why? Why? <laughs> poor guy. He's always picked up. But hey, you know, it made him famous. Sorry. More. Hold, hold it. Have fun. I have to go see a guy about a cage. Meow. Dang, girl. Get it. Just make sure that you give him some water. It, it, does the guy live in the cage? or? <laughs> Want to see something while the Cali Quake and the Jersey Quake were in a direct line to each other? That's yes, probably... I don't know. Yeah. But everything on a circular globe, if you think it's circular, will be aligned <laughs> with each other. Silly, silly non-flat earthers. <laughs> yeah. Everyone knows the reason we have mountain is because the turtle moves its back. Yes. It's just the way it is. <sighs> no, it wouldn't be a Baker stream, not just a stapulate. I heard mountains wait, were other things. Wait until New Madrid decides to say hi. Hmm. New Madrid. I'm not sure. Who's New Madrid? And why would they be saying hi? They could say hello. Yeah. Uh, hey, Joe. We just started. And, and listen, it's 45 minutes. You could pee before we started class. You know, we start at nine every day. Hey, Joe, what no are you doing with that gun in your hand? <laughs> How about when the Mississippi float backwards? Oh, I didn't know that. I have to look that up. That was the mm -hmm. thing. We uh, we forced the Chicago River to flow backwards, and it's still doing it. Dog <laughs> rescues. Uh -oh. <laughs> she, she plays on tossing them some cash and leaving. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> oh, Wanda. Good morning, Wanda. Is the plate in the middle of the country? No, actually, the entire... Well... The dinner plate. Uh... So, so, so the plates are sitting on top of one another and they just shift like this and whatever they do. do, 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 do. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. That's why they put the big uh, springs in the buildings in California. So they can just sort of shift around. Springs and rollers is what they sit on. Kelly? Mm-hmm. 
Yeah. Oh, yeah, there's the plates. You have a... Oh, you can't draw on this one. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you can see it. You have the Mid-Atlantic Bridge going up through the middle of the Atlantic. Look at the only sexual interest in country. And also Denmark. <laughs> then you have the North American Plate, which is almost all of the North American uh, continent, except I don't know who Juan de Fuca is, but he's mentioned. He's probably Mexican too. Then you have the Pacific Juan de Fuca. Plate. <laughs> he's, he's a Fuca. Then you have or Cocos that and, Caribbean, and the Caribbean plates, the South Amer uh, American plate, the Nesca plate, the Atlantic plate, the Eurasian, that's all of Europe plus Micronesia, India plate, Somalia plate, Arab plate, the Africa plate, Australian plate, and the Pacific plate. All of these moves, move along. And when they grind like they do over here... I love it when they you grind. Have, you, you have a lot of commotion. This is a hot, uh, hot spot. This is a wow. hot spot. Yeah, and, there's a lot and, of there's a lot of friction whenever they yeah. grind. So where's and the uh, Ring of Fire at? Is that where the the, the Ring of Fire is? is uh, that's out by Hawaii, I think. Okay. Oh no! Oh, is it the 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 ridge that goes up by Japan because they have a lot of volcanoes too? Mm, that's true. Maybe it's down in this area because that's why you had the, the tsunamis over here too. It's whenever the the plates snap. Uh, they make those big ones. But the funny thing is you have the the tall mountains in the Himalayas because the Indian plate is, I think that's the fastest moving plate, and it's shoving itself under the European plate. So pretty, pretty soon India is going to just be shoved under that plate and we won't have India anymore? Actually, uh, uh, in no, more, no more customer service for me, huh? I'm pretty soon no. on a very long time scale. <laughs> yeah, on, on Earth time, but it, it's the same. Uh, the Horn of Africa will break off and, and go over on the other side of Arabia. It won't happen in our lifetime. You sure it, that, that that won't just end up over in Australia somewhere and just make Australia bigger? Yeah, because it moves upwards. Well, You, ha you have the, the plate, the, the way they transfer. You have, have them because you need, the, you need the expanding zones and the contracting zones. And see, see, Baker just showed us the whole the whole Earth right there, and it is yeah. flat. It is flat. I could have it on my screen. Yes, and it's very small. Oh, the New Madrid is in Tennessee. Okay. Again, named after a Spanish person. Oh, please. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I need to do that. <clears throat> yeah, I shouldn't uh, draw on PDF files i should just put them up on the wall yeah if, if, you, if you're drawing on pdf files you have to wipe your screen down after you're done yeah no it's fun it's very messy real foot lake created by earthquake in tennessee yep i'm at fault line no plate not plate <laughs> how, how come the scotia plate is so far from scotland well because <laughs> scotia is in uh canada I can't see the Scotia plate on my map. <laughs> oh, that's Pacific. The Pacific Ocean is the Ring of Fire, and uh, some part of me when I go to my Taco Bell date with Danielle. I fell <laughs> into a burning ring of fire. Yeah, it's actually interesting. The um, the Appalachian Mountains and the Scottish Highland are actually the same mountain range from way back. They just split apart over time hmm. yeah that's because you can put the puzzle together and make everything fit again yeah you just got to rub the plates together <laughs> jamie uh how do you take a uh, saturday school you don't need sunday school now no i still need sunday school you need yeah, jesus you have to do that with Farrell. i need sleep we all need a little bit of jesus jesus is just mm. all right by me but I'm I'm so mad we can't show those uh, Christian rap groups. Education. Oh God! Christian rap group. Why? Oh, they're because so the funny. copyright strike everything. Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Yeah. They, though it's actually funny that uh, the Christians are some of the worst uh, copyright strikers. Maybe because oh, they yeah. really. 
Yes. You made so much fun oh, of yeah. it. <laughs> yes. That's funny. Oh, I've seen What's, that. I know the Lord and he is cool. I, and he said that go to Sunday school and stuff like that. You're just thinking, what the F? There was some that were like taking like actual songs I like and turn, and I was just like, no, no, no. <laughs> Turning them into like Christian songs. <laughs> well, it's like funny, right? Because like the group, The Killers, if you listen to a lot of their songs, they're actually a Christian group. Like, it's disguised as, like, poppy rock music, but The Killers, a lot of their stuff is pretty Christian. And you have, uh... What's so the... it's Charlie Daniels. Devil went down to Georgia. Mm-hmm. Uh, I th- who's the other group that all those, uh... uh Woe Me ladies yelled about, who's also a Christian group? Was it Striper? No, it was... Oh. Creed, Creed, wasn't it? Yeah, it was Creed. They were, they were, they were supposed to be like that. They were like the uh, what you, the Christian version of uh, Pearl Jam or something like that. Hmm. No, nothing, nothing like walking up to that guy and saying, saying, uh, asking him whenever Pearl Jam was going to be releasing a new album. Boy, that used to just tick him off so much. Really? <laughs> yeah. Because everybody would mistake him for Eddie Vedder. He's, I'm not Eddie Vedder. Stop it. Ah, yes. The Osmonds. Hmm. Yeah, I love that Genesis movie. Just was it last Sunday we watched that preacher guy? He uh, he lives by that Genesis movie. Oh, <laughs> the song. Sorry. Owners of the best halftime show at Super Bowl ever. Well, Let's uh, get back on track. This become an infomercial. That's not what Happy Days is about. Let's uh, clear our minds and get ready. <laughs> du, du, du. What? While I'm waiting for this, did you, whether it's true or not, believe that Mr. Randolph had slept with your wife? I wouldn't have cared. You wouldn't have cared? No. Did you believe he had slept with your wife? No. Did you believe he slept with your mother-in-law? Probably did. Everybody has. Everybody has. <laughs> the judge is like, the hell did you just? <laughs> I love the judge that is, just. That is Sorry, such what a did good you say? Clip. I love yeah, that and, so much. Oh, uh, he got convicted yesterday. Uh, oh, did he? He talked about he talked about him and, and his dead wife knew all rock songs in the world. He was weird. We have to watch it at some point, Jamie, when we get a moment. But before we do that, <laughs> we need to have a look at this. Guys, you know how it is. You have your wife. You have your lover. Oh, no. And not that they meet each other, but... Uh, and you know, you can bang the socks off your lover, but back home with the girlfriend, it's just not the same. Mm-hmm. Same became sex sex became an embarrassing problem with my partner. So I started an affair. Oh, which God. you should do. <laughs> That's exactly what you should do. Yeah. That's the solution. Mm-hmm. Now I can only perform with my lover, but I love my girlfriend and don't want to break up my relationship. Sorry, buddy. That yeah. ship shame. Sorry. Sale. Yeah, that's <laughs> <laughs> it's over. <laughs> I feel oh, you got the seven year itch. You got the seven yeah. year itch. That's what it is. I'm 38, she's 36. We've been together for seven years. Everything was great until I started finding it difficult to perform in bed. That's a you problem. It began when I had too much to drink one night. Soon it was happening every time we tried to have (laughs) snacks. That's one My partner told me not to worry, but I lost all confidence. You know, you can go to the doctor for a solution for that. Yeah, it's blue. (laughs) Then I discovered she had shared my intimate problems with her best friend. I was angry, and we had a a huge row. I stormed out to the pub, where I then got chatting to a woman in her early 20s. Always the best solution to erectile dysfunction, who made it very clear that she fancied me. I ended up going home with her. Mm -hmm. And it was such an exciting and naughty situation. Everything worked perfectly. Since then, we slept together several times. The smex is always great. 
It makes me feel like a proper man again. But I don't want to be with this woman. She's sweet, but not very interesting. <laughs> 22 year old girls are. <laughs> I feel oh, it's kind of boy. old out. <laughs> wow. It's, wow. it's my partner who I love. I feel so guilty. The problem is, every time I, I try to smex with my partner, I still can't get a owner. An oin. Oh. <laughs> like there clearly is nothing physically wrong with me if I can manage it with my lover. What should I do? I don't want to give up my lover if it means never having smex again. Panel discuss. Oh, oh man. man. I mean, first of all, you you just have to know that your girlfriend's going to go tell her, all her friends about it. Like, it's just, it's going to happen. Like, I'm sorry, buddy, but they talk about it, everything. No, that's one thing I do not talk about <laughs> with my friends. But that's just me. We don't talk about not per being able to perform? I don't talk about that stuff with my friends. You don't need to know. Oh. Well... And okay. I just, I don't know. There's, most girls like, do. There seems like something going on between them more than just that one night when he was drunk. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Because. Uh, did he say he's drinking all the time when they're trying? I mean, that's going to. No, he said, no, no. He's, he said it just happened the one time whenever he was, whenever he was drunk that he couldn't perform and. And he just lost all confidence after she ratted him out and said, "Hey, buddy, he, his his little his little wing doesn't do much of anything anymore." It was yeah, That's so mean. But <laughs> see, see, here's 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 the thing. That well, JD fan, uh, JD fan raises a good question: Is the lover and girlfriend both female? Wait, no, he said yeah. she was young. He said that. Yeah, I thought it was young. yeah two ladies. Yeah, yeah, it was. It was. Um, no, no, here's, you know, if you, if you start having this kind of problem, then there's something else going on. Usually, usually there's something going on, but between you that isn't working and you need to get that stuff figured out like pretty quick. Like, well, I mean, it can also be like just a, like, you know, stressful situation just in life, like at work or something like no, something else. No. Cause he's able to, he's able to perform outside. Oh, of, uh, so here's, here, yeah. here's, here's, here's the thing. Make it naughty again with her, with your girlfriend, make it naughty and sort of, uh, you know, the, the, somebody who was explaining this not too long ago, they said, you know, you, you don't, you don't, you don't, um, F your, your, your wife, girlfriend the person that you're in love with you 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 don't do that whole nasty just like animal uh action because you're 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 trying to be sensitive to them and their needs and all this kind of crap no you, you have to stop thinking like that treat her like uh like a how, how do they put that treat her like a whore in bed but like a woman outside of bed yeah that's what we want. Lady in the streets, freak in the sheets. Yeah. Uh, Brandon Deirdre, as always said, end your, end your fan before anyone gets hurt and uh, focus on uh, getting back with your woman. What did Deidre oh. say? I, I don't care what Deidre said. I don't have this problem. So she can. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the next article from this guy, Deirdre, Deirdre, my lover is pregnant with my baby. Yeah, that will be. <laughs> That will be the next one. Yeah. Hello, Ronnie. Mm -hmm. Ronnie. I mean, it's just. Hello, Miss Ass. Rancher. She raises. Is there a response to these <clears throat> articles? Yeah. Yeah, it's it's just always uh, stop your affair and uh, yeah, it's it's fun mm -hmm. to bang a twenty-two year old, but uh, think think about it, she's twenty-two. Yeah, that, I, mean, I thought that was that was funny because it's so true. Talk like, what about do you really 22? have in common with a 22 year old when you're I don't know. I mean, 40. I'm 27, so probably quite a bit. <laughs> yeah. As 27 year olds, we well, have a you. lot of common with, uh... <laughs> not, when I said, not when you're almost 40 years old. A 22. Well, we, how would we know how it is when you're almost 40? Jamie, you're talking no. to two young stallions at 27. <laughs> yes. What's wrong with you? Uh, Three young stallions. Thank you. All right. Sure. Sure, sure, sure. Oh, Danny T. 
Can we get a cougar sound? Meow. <laughs> Meow. It, it sounded more like a constipated cat, but. Meow. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Danny's is the best. <laughs> she needs to come on here because she has got some. She has got a personality to like no other. Yeah, sign up over on uh, Waiting for Wings, and uh, we can uh, have you on sometimes, maybe. No. So, uh, because this is more or less turning into uh, Jamie is finding new girlfriends to uh, sit in the green room and gossip <laughs> with after the show. <laughs> yeah, I talked to Danielle. You talked for hours last time. Why, why, why do you think I showed up? Yeah, yeah because you're sitting there thinking, I want to know the Dollar Tree secrets. <laughs> I really do, actually. Like, Shut up. Share this is what my me. whole life is based off of. <laughs> <laughs> the Dollar Tree. I do love the Dollar Tree, though. Uh, <laughs> Dollar Tree is uh, amazing. All the all men, men, all the men. Yes. Mm. I, I mean, oh. maybe. I don't know. Sitting in this chair for eleven hours a day certainly isn't helping my back. What? You what have a. Is is your seat over aggressively? Uh, Cushioning. I remember when I took uh, my uh, my trailer uh, driver's license. The seat, I don't know if it was broken or something. It was so aggressively. Uh, so. Oh, the air seat. Yeah, no, this one's pretty stiff. The biggest problem I have is that um, because of the cabinets right behind me, the the it has to be straight up. I like to drive with it a little bit back, but mm. it's just not an option. Because I'm also like I'm six feet tall, so I have to have the seat back to be to like comfortably reach the pedals and stuff. It's just annoying. Well, you should move it forward so your arms will actually reach the steering wheel. I know that's the hardest part, and also like the weight of the tail is like really like makes me not able to be able to move as much stuff. You, you know, exercise helps that. Some people like the thick tail, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I gotta saw, stop skipping leg day. I, I saw that uh, uh, today too. Have you seen that, Jamie? Ninety-nine cent stores is ceasing operations. Hmm. Whose? Whose operation? Ninety-nine cent. It's a it's a chain of stores. Yeah. Who's operating? I mean, Dollar Tree moved up yep. to Dollar Twenty Five now. Yeah. What I'm Dollar wondering Tree is, who who are they seizing though? That's what I'm wondering. They are closing down all their stores. Oh, that means they're seizing. Seizing. Seizing, seizing operations. It's in, operations. It said, no. But it said seizing. They're going to lay a siege on Dollar Tree. That's what I thought. It's <laughs> Libby can't write and I can't read. Don't have a, 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 a <laughs> against her. We we both know what we're talking about. That's that's why it works so well. Yeah. Oh my god. It's not a problem. <laughs> you're an idiot if I, the, the people you talk to are idiots as well. No, I thought I thought they were like seizing, like they were like on the ground, like oh. foam coming out of their mouth. I, I was thinking, what's the problem? I told it's seizing, it's ending, and then Brandon wrote it correctly. <laughs> I'm dyslexic in every language, and I know a lot of languages. <laughs> I bet you do. <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, I know the language of love. What is that? <laughs> because that's French. What is it? Do you know French? Latin? Well, let's hear it. Bonsoir, <clears throat> ça va? Then you answer me. I just asked you. Keep something. going. Um, C. <laughs> <laughs> Jamie, uh, tu ne parles pas français? Tu parles apparently, she, apparently, she doesn't speak French. Apparently not. Hmm. Okay. Parlez-vous français means do you speak French? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then you just look at, at someone and say, Je ne parle pas français. <laughs> but uh, I understand uh, naughty <laughs> words so you can hard. make with uh, <laughs> the dirty dancing because nobody put Jamie in the corner. 
<laughs> and then no. you just go go to town with that French guy. He's probably named Pierre. You'll get to, yeah. used to seeing it. He probably also speaks English too, by the way. You'll be fine, Jay. No, if he is if he's from France, no. France <laughs> is the most empty every other they can't use uh, like a, a computer in Denmark is a computer just with a Danish accent because <laughs> it's a pretty boring ball it's it's what it is but friends have to have their own words for it to protect the French language yes and it's what is the name of it it's a uh, such a stupid word I can't remember off the top of my head. Yeah, it's <laughs> it, it, he's right. It, it is. It's it an is. ordinateur. A computer in what French is, is an ordinateur. I hate so if you go in right there and now. say, "Can I borrow your computer?" They will say, "Que? Je... Que pasa? Que pa pasa? <laughs> El stupido." <laughs> No, so uh, uh, they they have to they they I think they have a certain amount of borrowed words they can have. And it's French is a crazy place, just as yes, it. it is. Although if you end up in like Paris, they probably will speak a little bit of English to you, but be jerks about it. Well, Par Paris yeah. Paris is uh, Paris is not really French. No, Sorry. not really. It is it's, it's it's really a mess. I was I was surprised. I mean, you know, it's it's sort of the same way as Brittany. They 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 have their own language. You know, if you, if you go you go to Brittany, they 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 really don't want to be part of France, but France the France wants them to be part of, you know, France. Kind of like Quebec and Canada as well. <laughs> I don't know. It's weird. It's weird. Munza. Munza. They seem snobby. And greasy. I uh, I was in uh, Le Havre uh, once when we played a, a concert, and it was hot as balls. And uh, one of the girls just got a heat stroke. And uh, the guy, one of the guys I, I met is half German. His dad is German. So he ran in and said, Can this piece of Wasser haben? Bitte, bitte, we have a problem. Everyone in the bar just turned around and showed him his, his back. We're talking in the 90s, 50 years later. Yeah, I know it's a big deal, but still, there's a girl outside. And then uh, the, another guy came in and said, hey, we have one uh, who had a heat stroke. Can I get some water? Sure, my friend, no problem. Come on, my friend, you get water. But because you talk German, uh -uh, we don't talk to you. It's such a such a weird country. <laughs> I hate it. <laughs> hey, Sophia Stalin. A person well, I they're hate. still upset about that one time that they got Oh, I'm sorry. Actually, the two times they got occupied by Germany. Well, it, only two. The Rhineland uh, has been occupied more than that. <laughs> no, it's uh, Germany's. I'm just. Let's let's be honest. It had been cooler if they had tried 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 three times within a century, just to see uh, them lose the hat trick. <laughs> balls are hot they are well especially Although, if you try to get them fixed during the middle of an earthquake oh, poor guy Although I got a croissant and some dumpy quick service place at That's some dumpy quick service place at uh, the Louvre and it was amazing they can bake pastries and that's about it well yeah, yeah. The food is good when it's good, but they are also it's kind of like India. If it moves, we eat it. Snails, mm -mm -mm. escargot, yeah. tastes like gummy and uh, and uh, no. But uh, having uh, sitting sitting in uh, in Paris on a little cafe and eating a croissant or. A, I'm more fond of uh, chocolate, um, but you have to listen to all the French people. It's almost the thing that makes me not really want to go to America. There's a lot of Americans over there. Yeah. <laughs> I know. It really it's so unfortunate. unfortunate. So many Americans over here. So <laughs> unfortunate. <laughs> well, the Marseille isn't that close to the Louvre. 
No. 26. Local Canadian Frenchman around here. I throw me down the stairs my shoes. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I'm just sad. Uh, I, I'm, I've taken friends twice, but I just, it doesn't stick. I don't use it enough. It's funny that friends are known for retreating. Do anyone know that little uh, guy who wasn't that little? Napoleon. Not the one played by Joaquin Phoenix, but the uh, crazy general. Yeah, he he beat most of Europe. Yeah, he did. You took the train to Paris and everyone was having issue with the local train ticket machine and the workers pretended not to speak English. Then 15 minutes later, I hear them speaking English. Yeah. Oh, yeah, they do that. Uh huh. <laughs> it's uh, it's the, kind of the same thing. Uh, if we have obnoxious tourists and... Uh, I say obnoxious tourists and Jamie makes hearts. Uh, hey, Jamie. Jamie. Do, 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 do this one. What does that one do? I can't remember. I don't... Just see. Does that... How, how and do you, then do, you, do just one of them. I just I don't understand how to get that to work. All balloons. And then do write them down. Do this one. What's the? <laughs> you can just do one, and I think it yeah. does a. Like... Yeah. And then you can also do the thumbs down. <laughs> she has an iPhone. You yeah. can do it on an iPhone. But does it work on yeah. MacBook then? I'm on a MacBook. No, not unless you're using know. your iPhone. If you use your iPhone as the camera on the MacBook, you can. Oh, okay. Libby is always getting Manscaped commercials on my channel. I think they're trying to mm. tell you something. They want to sponsor me? Oh. Um, maybe they're trying to tell you something. Libby, maybe they're trying to tell you something. Yeah. Yeah. Well, uh, we can't all be Dolphin Boy. <laughs> you know, he had to quit. He had to quit her. <laughs> He's like, I'm quitting you because you never could. <sighs> but a t 10 in French, the Danish system, we have a stupid uh, number system. So that's that's the, like the third hi highest grade you can get. But that's pretty good. And now all I can say, this is a book. It's the same hey, with uh, Donde, no, not Donde, uh, La Pubelle et la Classe. So I have a question because, because, uh, is, is how, how would class. you, how would you, how would you say her name? Maya. Okay. But you would probably right. say Maya or something to try yep, and pronounce the J. Yep. So it's Maya. Cool. Thanks. Cause yeah. she comes into my chat and I, I want to make sure that I, I say it right. Yeah, but uh, her name is Maya Lun because we don't really pronounce the J and the D. Gotcha. Maya Lun. Sounds like I'm alone. <laughs> Am I alone now? Uh, no, like I said yesterday, I can two two phrases in, in well, I can three phrases in Spanish. Dollywood, be on what? alert, anti-American, Dane, and rude. Well, I'm anti <laughs> I'm not anti-American. I'm anti-everything not Danish. Yeah. So that makes me not, not Danish. <laughs> He's just that a big nationalist. Me, it makes me not racist because I just don't like anyone else. It's just I don't like. It's not that I don't like Americans or Africans or no. I just don't like any people who's not Danish. Just ask Penilla. <laughs> She's Danish. Not that I don't like you, it's just I don't like anyone else. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And that's why you can't be uh, racist, because if you don't like anyone, you can't hate them. <laughs> Dolph dolphins, are out, <laughs> dolphins. dolphins are out and foxes are in. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shame. Shame, Puddle Town. <laughs> Baker does, does not like everyone, y'all. I do like everyone. I love you, Tia Nia. Mm. Tia's great. What do you could get have, when a Dolly Parton... Could have fooled me, Baker. Could have fooled me. 
Did you read that? Did you hear that really nice note that he read for you? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Everyone liked the Jamie. That, <laughs> the one that he made up and made everybody think it was me. Uh -huh. Yes, the one, the one I made up, not the one that you sent over to me. <laughs> no, Jamie. Yeah, we got you. Mm -hmm. I need to come to Colorado and go to Dragon Man's. You'll never want to leave the U.S. afterwards. Well, well that's at some point, you... some point we have to do like a Midwest gathering to so to meet people in the Midwest. Oh, that's West. Yeah, that's West. Colorado is. Gotta come my way, and then we can go I over to uh, we can go over to Massachusetts and hang out. <laughs> I love T Rex. It's so Paul being on the channel. He's just a gifting membership to get us to share. <laughs> no, that's not true. <laughs> but uh, those memberships went to Carolyn, Emma Lemaray, FD Food Fairy, Pape, a mess. Oh, I'm so glad FD Food Fairy got one. Aww. It's member milestone chat day. Now get back to work. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Thank you for being a member for five months. Do, do, do. You're so nice, T-Rex. Thanks. I actually have a, a video I thought we should see because it's a potential case Jamie and I might be covering. Oh, okay. I was what? So, uh, <laughs> and it's uh, by request of Marissa, who uh, apparently is my booker now and tells me what I show, uh, should show on, on screen. It's so nice. I don't have to run my channel. Jamie tells me when to get up and people tell me what to do. Nice. So, uh, one can only uh, dream to have things done for them. Teamwork yeah. makes the dream work. Come on, <clears throat> exactly. And uh, I just have to waltz my little behind out here and shake it for the ladies. That's right, that's all you got to do. I mean, you act like, act like it's such yeah. a bad thing, not too no. much though, because you got to leave something for mystery, you know. That's why that's why the G string comes in, <laughs> you just get a peek. <laughs> I, I I don't know if you mean receiving or gifting memberships on Android. I have no. Uh, I know um, uh, iPhones have a problem. Is T Rex a trucker? Yes, he is. I absolutely am. He's a long haul trucker. Oh yeah. I do have handlers. <laughs> yeah, and, and and then you yell at me for not noticing. No, I, I don't like it. I'm just being dominated because I'm not strong enough to say, please don't dominate me. No. Jamie no. would just yell more. And not, now Marissa is angry. I said she she recommended it. No, I didn't. So she she recommended the first one. Hmm. You should break down do a breakdown of the river stipulation on a members only stream. But what can I break down in it? It's. I mean, it's pretty straightforward in my opinion. Yeah, and the problem is I can't really show the video. It will be uh, struck by YouTube probably. <laughs> probably, unfortunately. Thank you, Judge Maddie. Yeah, because I really wanted to talk about it. Hey, Noel Perry from the Chile, Idaho. He showed the the popster uh, in the beginning. He did. It might be back. Yeah. Puppies. They're awesome. Best or worst states for trucking? Oh, I'm going to get yelled at. Um, <laughs> um, The best states are anywhere that isn't Indiana or Arkansas. They have terrible roads in Indiana and Arkansas. So if you've been through, like, Mississippi, Louisiana? Yeah, they're not too bad. Um, What is that, 20 straight through there is what I usually do? No, like the... 10 oh 10 um a little bit i haven't taken 10 all the way across yeah you try taking the 10 through mississippi louisiana you'll you'll have a different opinion <laughs> is, that, <laughs> is that where that really long bridge is over the bayou in um in louisiana yeah i, I, I have 356 I brandon 356 members nice Hi, Iris. I, What's up, Iris? How you doing? 
she's saying hello to her oh, girlfriend. Uh, she's not saying hello, hello to us. It's okay. She could just just talk Spanish to me. It's fine. <laughs> I I like Brandon's solution to the iPhone problem. I need to raise my prices or uh, get more subs or move out of Denmark, and you can do memberships from iPhones. <laughs> yeah, the only problem is I have two kids. I really, I, I, well, I I can say I like them most of the time. So I really want to be, because there might be grandkids sometime very very soon. So. Uh, it's I, I don't know. Let's see uh, if uh, anyone kidnaps me uh, while I'm in in Tennessee. Then I might stay. We never know. It's only a sixteen hour flight. They can fly if uh, they need someone to take care of the babies. Well, that that's that's why that's why um, that's why you keep all those women around you. You know they'll they'll, they'll cut anybody trying to kidnap you. There's some dangerous yeah. women. What kind of truck are you driving? It is a 2023 Freightliner Cascadia. <laughs> well, how big are they? They're 20 and 22. So uh, if you know someone uh, who uh, works with taxation, who can uh, get my girl a really good job, and, well, I don't care. Her boyfriend, he, he, he makes trucks. Uh, but we can leave him at home. And the other one, just get her a high-paying job. We'll look into it. Iris is going on stream? I don't think so. No, having grandkids at 27 is not easy. I, I know. Mm, yes, I know. It's horrible. Yeah, I if I hear banjos, I'm running. I, I know what that means. I've seen the movies. Yeah, but that was not in Tennessee. That was in Alabama. Yeah, I think uh, crazy doesn't know state lines. Coffee is amazing. Um, the um, don't worry about the the banjos. They're they're nice people. Yeah, it's the people who say squeal like a pig boy. I have to worry about. Mm. Isn't that Deliverance? Isn't that a different movie? I don't know. I've never seen it. Yeah, that's deliverance. Yeah. Well, uh, you still have to fix my daughter up with the job first, then. And I'm not sure they want to go to the states. I don't know. So, <laughs> right. Yeah, it's the mute, mute albino kids playing the banjo. Mm. It was filmed in Georgia. Yeah, GA is Georgia, right? Mm -hmm. I'm yes, so G smart. GA is Georgia. The town, not the country. Or the, <laughs> the, the state, state, not the country. <laughs> yeah, it, it supposedly happened in, in Tennessee. Supposedly. Yeah, if they say, uh, can we ride together on this horse, barebacked? I'm also running. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. As a horse. But uh, let's look at this uh, possible pro se litigant. Who is this? Oh, this one. Do mm. a bio break. She looks I'm so fun. she looks so angry. Like, thank you for imposing upon my time oh, being here. Miss Anderson, for the record, would you state your full name, please? Yes, I am Princess Kalika Hatan Tupacre II, representing the entity Dejon Anderson. <laughs> Dejon Anderson? I'm representing the entity of Dejon Anderson. Oh, God. She's what now? My date of birth is February 2nd, 1961. That would make you how old? That would make me 63 years old. And the last four digits, your social security number? I do not have a social security number. I have a declaration of nationality underneath the Washita Morris of the indigenous people of the United Nations, chapter 221593. She's not 60 What's your years address? Old. My address is. Oh, she's going to say. 
I thought she was going to say my address is F U and. <laughs> oh, more beeps. <laughs> She's really telling that judge so, huh? Yes, I do. If I say something you don't understand, will you let me know? I will most definitely will. Sanderson. Oh my. Officer Music, who's investigated this, worked for you for the past two years. And Prosecutor Hunt have charged you with three count, counts of criminal conduct. Count one is murder as a felony. Would indicate that between April the 10th, 2022, and April the 16th, 2022, in Washington County, state of Indiana, you did knowingly or intentionally kill another human being, that being child victim number one. Contrary to the form of the statute, such cases made and provided by Indiana Code 35-42-1. She looks kind. Yeah. And it gives peace and dignity to the state of Indiana. Jeez. Count two. Just so nonchalant about it. As yeah. a level one inconvenienced. <laughs> well, uh, the good the good part is when she starts talking. Oh, she mm. did. She called. She she gave her address as F U and the horse she rode in on is what her address was. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I didn't hear that one. Well, no, it was just a it was just a big long beep. Please don't play it again. <laughs> 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 no, great. And, she, uh, is, she just walked in there like, "What in the hell is going? Why? Why are you guys inconveniencing me?" Yeah, I was just I was, com- I was comfy in my cell. Yeah, I mean, I get three you can squares. Hear somebody now. taking pictures, and she's giving them the face. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it, it's Indiana. This uh, this pause frame is exactly like the attitude. I feel like she'll have the whole ad- the whole trial. Yeah, and uh, to you youngins out there, because I have a huge young audience, if a a lady gives you this look, don't do it. (laughs) Don't, don't, don't. Don't. That would be bad. Like you hear about the crazy eyes; those are the crazy (laughs) eyes, right there. Take a good look. If you see them looking at you across the bar, it's not a "come get me" look. No. <laughs> She's yeah, a man Tia, we are all young. Twenty-seven is the average age on this channel. Yes. <laughs> Between <laughs> December the first, twenty twenty-one, and April the sixteenth, twenty twenty-two, in Washington County, state of Indiana, you being at late at least eighteen years of age and having the care of child victim one, a dependent, less than 14 years of age, did knowingly place said dependent in a situation that endangered the dependent's life or health, and which resulted in the death of child victim one. <laughs> Count three, obstruction of justice as a level six stone would indicate that between April the 10th 2022 and April the 16th, 2022, in Washington County, State of Indiana. You I agree, Paul. Damage or remove a record, document, or thing with the intent to prevent said item from being produced. Or I, I hate people who lie about the age. Proceeding or an administrative <laughs> criminal investigation, mm, okay. contrary to the form of the statutes made and such case provided. The murder, a felony has a range of imprisonment from 45 years to 65 years with the advisory sentence being 55 years and up to a ten thousand dollar fine the level one felony why do they build the these forts for the judges has a range of <laughs> they don't work clearly you saw that video advisory sentence being 30 years yeah and up to a ten thousand <laughs> that is giant and the level six felony has a range of imprisonment of no time in jail, street as a misdemeanor, to two and a half years at the Indiana Department of Corrections, with the advisory sentence being one <laughs> up to a $10,000 fine. Do you understand what you've been charged with? I do understand. Okay. And do you understand the potential penalties? I do. 
Oh, she got to pick you one. You intend to hire a lawyer mm -hmm. or is someone likely to hire a lawyer for you? Uh, I want to file a motion for self-representation. Oh. Oh, my. Wow. A pro oh. say murder case. I am so <laughs> following this. Oh, jeez. This is going to be gold. Love it. Yeah. Oh. I kind of like this court setup. I, it feels like uh, it's the stern of a battleship. Mm -hmm. Do you know why? No, I just started watching this. I, I haven't seen it. So was it her kid or just a dependent? Like mother of boy found dead in suitcase takes makes first call appearance. So, but if she's if she's as old as she's saying she is, I, it makes me think maybe she was just responsible for the child. Maybe had adopted the child. Mm. I don't know. She's not that old. She's lying about her age. Oh, oh. is she? She, Someone she's said she's actually like body. Yeah. <laughs> I was going to believe 62. Daryl Brooks in a... Oof. Yeah, I saw something about this earlier. I was... I, and I I just didn't... I was like, I'm covering one suitcase and, and already I <laughs> wasn't sure I needed two, but now that... Oh, geez. Yeah. I see what see what Tuesday's going to bring for me. <laughs> What's her name? Uh... If you and the horse you brought, rode in on, I think what's her name? <laughs> no, that's her address. Like Princess Pony. Princess Khalifa. It was like Princess lady, Khalifa. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Princess rep 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 representing the entity known as uh, something horse, you know, cow, something. She's 38 and it was her son. Mm -hmm. She's 38 and it was her son. Jeez. Supper of Louisville. You understand if you do that, you are required to conduct yourself as a lawyer to be able to uh, order uh, potential jurors to abide by the rules of evidence, to abide by the rules of Dijon. I do understand. I have a master's in history. That doesn't give you a law degree, though. But I do understand how to read procedures and understand right. the court procedures. Right. Just because. Oh. Just because you represent yourself, that, that, doesn't, make, that doesn't ensure yourself okay. a good lawyer, you know. That's a personal opinion, but I understand. I don't think it's August 25th because writing. that's a Sunday. Okay. I will, most definitely. Uh, uh, can you give me at least just like five days and I could get it I to you? I can certainly give you five days to do that. I think what my intention would be, let me ask you this. Between Any a princess and Diddy. Sorry. Um, it's not that I can't afford a lawyer. It's that I want to do self-representation due to I understand the nature of my case. And I understand that this is my life on the line. And I, I do understand that there are things that involve my case as far as the evidence that I hold, which is Q classified evidence, which should be turned over Q to classified. Q classified, Q classified huh? if possible. Because my case involves other cases that are open currently with Judge Advocate General Courts, as well as federal investigations that are open. Well, Who I think they she... can if they don't find them competent. We have, but they have crazy. to, but they would have to put her in front of a psychiatrist to find her incompetent, and I it would be. Yeah. And it's not that she can do that herself. It would have to be the prosecution or somebody Somebody would have to step in to, to actually force that in that competence hearing. But it actually seems like it's, there's a low bar for that. You know what I mean? Like really to represent yeah. yourself. Yeah. It's, I mean, yeah. look at Daryl Brooks. He represented himself. That was a, yeah. Yeah. She didn't go to the V classified. Yeah. That's a whole different thing, Whiskey. One manscaped ad and one Rogaine. Well, <laughs> can you use Rogaine on your manscape area? <laughs> no, no. I don't think she has other cases open, but her case is connected because you have to understand it with cube clearance. It's, uh, it's a little yeah. high up there. Yeah, you don't understand cube clearance. It's it's one of those if you know you know kind of things. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. 
I guess. The judge advocate general uh, approaches us will address it at that point. Okay. How about I appoint you standby counsel? Oh, no, thank you. I know what? I would take it. What? You make your written request. I need to advise you, you have a right to a speedy public trial by jury in this county. You have the right to face all witnesses against you, see your question and cross-examine those witnesses. You have the right to have witnesses brought into court to testify on your behalf. And at your request, the court will issue subpoenas requiring those individuals to come into court to testify on your behalf and bring evidence in. You have the right to have the state prove you guilty beyond a reasonable doubt. You have the right to remain silent. You cannot be required to give any testimony or make any statements against yourself to anyone. You do have the right to be heard in your own defense at any hearing or trial concerning the charges against you. Anything you say, however, may be used against you. Do you have any questions concerning your rights? No, I do not. Okay. Then I will set this matter for a pretrial conference on the 25th day of April at 9 a.m. A trial date of the 6th day of August of this year at 8.30 a.m. and an omnibus date of June the 15th. Do you have any questions at all? No, I do not have any questions. Right. You'll sign this reappearance slip. We'll discuss the issue. She's posing for the camera. Ms. Hunt, what's the state's position? Yes, Your Honor. Um, Given the gravity of this case, uh, first of all, I would like for you just to take judicial notice of the probable cause affidavit that the state filed in support of these three charges, as, uh, which resulted in the arrest warrant. I'd also like to bring to the judge's attention that it's almost a two-year mark of officers locating um, this, at the time, un un unidentified little boy in the woods. Um, so I would argue that the defendant has been a fugitive since that time has uh, her identification has been made. Um, I think that raises any bond in a murder case to be something uh, of the utmost importance and should be of an amount that should be very difficult, if not impractical, for her to to be able to afford Hi, or I feel she will be uh, <coughs> absconded from this, this court. She objects. She's never been she objects. She's not from Washington County, is my understanding. Mm -hmm. She was located in, in California. So on that reserve, I would leave that to the court. I really hope we get some more time. Uh, and if further motion is needed on the state's behalf, I will make that. Thank you, sir. Um, Ms. Anderson, yes. you just made an objection. Yes. State the basis of your objection. The basis of my objection is the fact that I am not a fugitive. I have been under NSA surveillance for the past eight months. And how can that qualify me as a fugitive on the run when oh, I also had a detail from Space Force that was following my every move? When I contacted... <laughs> Wait, what? Space Force. Wow. Space Force? Space, Space Force has been Force. tracking me your every move. I love it. Why? <laughs> all, Why are you... all around. <laughs> Why is she uh, so important? God. Space Force is a very important stuff. It's, it's about that. Yeah. It must be. A, they must be following her because of that Q level clearance she has. Yeah, yeah that's got to be it. She, she has really? all, Q level clearance. Yeah, yeah. That, that's uh. She's a really important lady. Yeah, she and is. imagine Trump made a special branch of the military just to track this lady. <laughs> just to track princess. Yeah, princess yeah just when good. we hear the X-Wing, we're not laughing anymore. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, more objections. <laughs> yeah, she's probably going to see us win. Cue the mental health. <laughs> like <that>. <laughs> <laughs> she parked her spaceship. Naughty squirrel, squirrel admin. Squirrel admin. <laughs> Can we like send her there and like, forget about her? <laughs> no, I, <didn't. laughs> I didn't even know, but like, yeah, the cops, be oh. I didn't even notice the cops behind the orchard. This lady's yeah. nuts. <laughs> We've heard this before. All right. Well, Indiana State well, let me tell you, me. that is not a valid legal objection. If you want to represent yourself, you're going to have to learn the rules of evidence and the rules of procedure. 
because if you conduct yourself like this and make these types of objections, you have no chance in the world. <laughs> he doesn't even play. He doesn't even play. He's just like, wow. you have no chance in the world, lady. Well, thank you. Oof. So that's my, my argument is that I have been under surveillance by NSA for over eight months. I also have a detail that follows me everywhere I go from Space Force Military. As in, to, I also contacted Indiana State. I think it was a federal marshal that I called to have my location tracked to pick me up. So there's no type of extent of me running where I need this astronomical bond on my charges. Well, that's sort of interesting because it's my understanding Officer Busick has been in touch with almost every one of those agencies and they haven't been able to identify <laughs> your location until recently. So, I mean, that's about right. Oh. But, <sighs> but did that, the guy who contacted him, did he have Q clearance? Maybe. Question, Maybe. Isn't it? Yeah, because. <laughs> It's, He's been in contact with all of those organizations. Also, <laughs> yes, he was. I'm also really glad that she said it. I contacted somebody from India. I think it, Indiana. I think it was a federal um, marshal. Right. Like, mm -mm. That's not how that works. I have. Yeah, that would have been a state. She doesn't. Know. Yeah. <laughs> no. <Except laughs> she, no. <laughs> she I bet she feelings. I bet she thinks she's know. in the Truman Show. I want her to tell me how important she is. I want to know what she's up to. <laughs> yeah, it's she again. It's Q clearance. I don't think uh, even Biden has that clearance. I hope not. <laughs> oh goodness! Gracious. Did you see Marissa's comment? <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> Oh, God. Anything else? No, Your Honor. Of course, that's what happened. All right, we'll be off record. Oh, my. 144. You can. She's remanded to the custody of the Washington County Sheriff's Department. Thank you, Judge. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, my God. Wow. Well, isn't she precious? She is so precious. Hmm. Uh, two years on the run? Mm -hmm. So is it Dijon or is it D1? Nope. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Just curious. <laughs> is it? Oh, nope. Not that. Uh, <laughs> not that. <laughs> 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 All right. Based on what I've just heard, I'm going to ask someone from the public defender office to be assigned to represent Ms. Anderson. Uh, if she files a, a written request and demonstrates that she has the ability uh, to understand and comprehend uh, and represent herself, I mean, I think just by that statement, she's proven she is not yeah, competent enough. Mm, yeah. I think it's appropriate that someone from the public defender office be assigned to if private hat counsel is hired, they can withdraw. We'll be now. We'll be off record. Nice, good job on the judge. He's not playing around. <laughs> no, I I'm liking this judge. He's like, well, I yeah, I, I hate this nonsense. This woman's talking about space. You know, and... <laughs> but you know, there's got to be someone in the public defender's office that's just going. Oh yeah, this is going to be fun. Oh, yeah, <laughs> either like, one or the other. They're like, oh, Jesus, not again. Or they're going, like, please not me. Please, please not me. <laughs> I mean, they're going to get paid the same amount regardless of what they do. Might as well just, you know, make a, make a game out of it. Like a drinking game. Just collect them all during the day. And then at night, you know. I'm sorry. I'm just watching Puppy about to fall asleep in your lap. Just like, hey, but. I know. He's got the prettiest uh, eyes. As long as he doesn't see a squirrel. 
Well, if I'm not well, mistaken, that can be dangerous for for dogs with those because they can they can go blind much easier. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I've been thinking about getting him some doggy sunglasses. Oh my god, stop it! Get all the doggy sunglasses. <laughs> Hi, puppy. Oh, well, looking at the ball. The woke the beast the in the living room. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, what is well, it? What is your puppy's uh, name? His name is Crypto with a K, like Superman's dog. Oh, okay. I thought yeah. I thought you were going to say something like Junior or something. T Rex, nah. Junior, Little Rex. <laughs> nah, he had the name at the shelter. Nice. What was the name of that little thing? Uh, that little uh, uh, dinosaur from from the cartoons, Littlefoot, or something. Littlefoot. I don't know. Oh, from, from like uh, that little, what is it? The Land Before Time? Is that what it was? Yeah, I think that's what That was a cartoon. That was a It was, movie. yeah. That was a movie. I think it was both. Oh. I guess not a brand new, just out of school attorney. Oh. Yeah. It's My dogs hear the word puppy. puppy. Nice. Yep, there it is. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> She's in the other room, too. Yeah, she heard Lot Lizard, and she was like, "I got to protect T Rex." <laughs> <laughs> yes, I, I woke him up. He really wants to go back to sleep. I'll let him do. That. He's a brontosaurus. Yeah, I'm more of a thesaurus. <laughs> a thesaurus. <laughs> oh my god! I'm a stuckosaurus. <laughs> but that woman, though, she is friggin' crazy, huh? I love it. I love it. What are these people like? What are supposed to say that they thought the the child was like a hundred years old? Mm. She made wild claims. Uh, she was tracked by Space Force. She was uh, cuffed just two weeks ago in Khalifas after nearly two years on the run. That was after her son Cairo Jordan, five years old, was found unalived in the woods in rural Indiana. Uh, she made several wild claims, including that she was a sovereign citizen, is part of several o- other o- uh, investigations, and is, in fact, a princess. <laughs> the oh. claims, which include that she's being tracked by the U.S. Space Force, re- raises doubt whether she can stand trial. She was cuffed just two weeks ago, came after five-year-old uh, Cairo Jordan was found unalived inside a suitcase in woods of rural Washington County. Sparking the search for Anderson, who is now charged with murder, neglect of a dependent, and obstruction of justice. Oh, that was a pretty, pretty that's little a boy. Cute little guy. Man. Oh, he's so cute. He is. Still on Tuesday, she insisted on representing herself. You are known as Dwan Anderson, said Washington County Judge Larry Matlock, before warning the woman to, that representing herself could. Oh, that's something missing. I'm representing <laughs> the entity of Dwan Anderson, she replied, wide-eyed and smiling. My name is Princess Ka- Kalfia Atonte Pape the second, representing the entity Dwan Anderson. The jurist went on to ask her if her decision was because she couldn't afford a lawyer, which she responded that she could. It's not that I cannot afford a lawyer, she said. Uh, I understand the nature, and I understand that this is my life. As for her date of birth, Anderson claimed to be over 60, telling the jurist, my date of birth is February 2nd, 1961. That makes you how old? That would make me 63 years old. When asked for the last four digits of her social security number, Anderson said she didn't have one. Another erroneous claim. Uh, Oh, and this is the suitcase. Oh, no. Of course, a Las Vegas one. Oh, Instead, she recited the United Nations Declaration before again asking to represent herself in upcoming proceedings. I do not have a social security number. I have a declaration of nationality. She then claimed that a Space Force military detail has been following her every move and assertion of offered in the form of an formal objection. <sighs> I've been on an NSA surveillance for the past eight months. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, jeez. Oh. oh, he's such a sweet little boy. 
An autopsy revealed that the young boy died from an electrolyte imbalance caused by dehydration from vomiting and diarrhea a week before his body was found crammed in a suitcase. I'll go into this. Uh, uh, yeah. Wow. As he delivered the decision, he appears to offer a slight dig at the accused, telling her, if Space Force comes forward and tells me they are willing to monitor you, we'll take up the issue of bond at a later time. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> oh, good one. Yes. Good one. Uh, They said the marshals. Oh, yes, yeah. Mm. Oh, he found inside out. trash bags, stuffed inside a suitcase, and dumped in the woods, eventually leading cops to Anderson's accomplice, Juan Coleman, who in November received a sentence of 30 years with five years of suspended probation. She was charged with aiding, inducing, or causing neglect of a dependent resulting in unaliving or an obstruction. Both women posted insensibly to social media referencing demons and exorcism with Anderson even reaching out to FR, I don't know, Vincent Lampert, priest for the Archdiocese of oh, Indianapolis, father. our father, to tell him that her son was possessed. I have survived the death attack from my five-year-old throughout the five years he has been alive, she wrote in a tweet. I have been able to weaken his power through our blood. I have his real name and he is a hundred years old. Need assistance. <laughs> as part of a plea deal, Coleman, who built herself as a spiritual healer on social media by the name of Mama God. <laughs> Mama God. Oh, no. Oh, I want to see her social oh, media God. now. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> Admitted to walking into a bedroom of Anderson's home where she witnessed the mom lying on top of her son who was face down in the bed with her face into the mattress, as Cop said. It was already done when she walked in, and Anderson had only asked her to help out put Cairo in a trash bag and then into the suitcase. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. Fucking psychos. Uh, they put it... Uh, uh, died from vomiting, which led to... Uh, uh, Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Sovereign citizens, the defense Anderson on Tuesday turned to do not believe they are bound by federal or state laws and have to comply with any type of law enforcement. Many often do not believe that they are required to pay taxes either. The FBI considers the group to be an extremist organization. Well, so are Christians in their eyes. Well-known members include Terry Nichols, the Oklahoma City boom, while unproven proponents include the grandfather who fought Pittsburgh police over his impending house eviction with a six-hour pew-pew battle in this past August. A police source named the man as, I, I don't know why, the man died and relatives said it doesn't matter, it has nothing to do with this. No. No, no this can't be right. Do you find something interesting? Oh, please. I hope it's not. Mm. Just just don't go to Twitter and, and do a search for Mama God. I'm telling you, because the, the at symbol just tells you all that you need to know. Oh, no. Uh, well, share it. Oh, uh, no, because there's too much dirty pictures on there. I can't do it. <laughs> Oh Jesus! Uh, here, I'll I'll I'll, sh I'll share it with you so you can sort of so you can see what the name of her at is. <laughs> Galactic. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> and it says, "Look where where uh, she's she's located at." She's located the universe, Lady Bits. <laughs> oh no. Oh boy! Yes. Oh. How how did she post anything on the 29th? Of, no, she just reposted. Uh, I don't know who that is. Maybe that's not them. That's somebody. Yeah, someone is just reposting a lot of uh, scantily clad women, female lawyers who are also baddies on and off their uniforms. <laughs> Baker's like, I'm <laughs> saving that for later. I'm having to uh, go back and make sure. 
I do my my research. Dude, you gotta be you gotta be diligent. You gotta do practice due diligence. Yeah. <laughs> People are saying uh, you you never prepare for shows. Well, some shows I do. There's, there's actually yeah. nothing I can bring up because there's nothing here other than just repost of everything. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So, uh, no, there's, yeah, the, the, the name brings up all kinds of like placentia health tablets and stuff like that. I don't, uh, I, I, I don't know. There's something weird about these, these folks. Yeah. They, they seem a little cray cray. <laughs> I think. What? Hmm. What did I do? Hey, what? White Rabbit. I'm so sorry. Hey, I didn't what's up, White Rabbit? Morning. I woke up eight minutes after the show ended. <laughs> yeah. Baker needed his sleep. Yeah, I didn't get any. No, we're not going to do it live because uh, there was a lot of titlets. Yes, there was quite a bit. I don't even <laughs> know if it's the right person. We can't do that live. But. So, Baker, what do you think about covering this once it goes to trial? Well, what did he say? The 6th of August? Well, I don't have anything on the schedule for August. Well, April the 25th, she's got a status hearing. Yeah, that's yeah, next we week. Don't, yeah. we don't even no, know that's, uh, don't... that's when Karen Reed is going. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Don't worry, I'll, I'll cover it. <laughs> so there you go, much. step on that. Yes. Oh my god. Yeah, it's an understatement. There's something weird about these folks. <laughs> certainly. Certainly. There's a lot of uh, yeah. of this. I'm seeing a lot more of these crazies that are like, oh, look at I'm living with this demon person. And that's their you know justification. Yeah, I mean, she's saying that that her child is a hundred years old, but you know, she's swapping out the blood or something. It's just like, okay, yeah, There's definitely something something didn't didn't quite work there. Scotty says the police state could save lots of cash by utilizing space force to monitor no bail funds. They refuse to log up. Angle monitor contracts are expensive for them. Yet they hire. Yet they are they are grift to con. Conundrum. 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 The conundrum. Yeah, they, 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 well, Space Force isn't doing much in space. So, uh, <laughs> should, should we bring back lobotomies? I'm just curious. No, we should bring back uh, uh, insane asylums. And it's all over the West because we have the same, we have a, West. we have a acute wing, we have a psych ward in, uh, in uh, our local hospital. And I have a, a lady who, who works at a place where they have people who, who needs around uh, the hour care. And um, some of them are are very volatile and uh, can change in a split. And and they can bring them out there, go pick them up two hours later when they come down. Then they go back, trash the entire place, go back out there because, yeah, we're going to save money once the place so you just have to take care of them. And we, we have a lot of simulations going on in the, our psych wards now. Uh, that's why I'm thinking I lobotomy think... story would stop that, right? No. Snake Island. Snake Island. Just drop them off on Snake Island. And just, just drop them off. Them. Just get them yeah. right out there. No, I don't have a lady. It's uh, my gym buddy who is a lady. She's married. So, I think uh, she was talking about the stabulating crazy people. Can we just... Yeah, but, but see, that would be cruel and unusual punishment, Jamie. If you're sending them to Snake Island, you have to at least give them something like maybe a big lighter or something like that. No. Oh, come on. It might get dark. You don't want to be scared of the dark. Mm -mm. Okay, a stick. Light a stick on fire. Like there you go. <laughs> they get the... Sure, they, get a, a, they get a big lighter with, with half the fuel missing. How's yeah, that? There you go. Okay, there you go. Does that make you feel better? <laughs> yeah, it makes you feel better. It's a little more humane. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Just a little bit. It's that's all she wanted. 
I mean, because, you know, those people that go there, they really, you know, I mean, good God, she just stuffed a child in a suitcase. I think Snake Island's the best she's going to get. Would, would filming it be, be improper? I mean, oh my God, that, that could be like fun. a 24 hour watch party or at least a couple of watch party. Be like, yeah. Yeah. See, coming up with ideas. We got plans. We got big plans for this country. And then, uh, you know, yeah. we, we drop we drop them off on the Snake Island. It's a YouTube live stream, and all the all the um, all the super chats go to mental health, uh, actual solutions to mental health. Oh, oh even well, better. here's the problem. Even better, you I could don't... gamble on it. You could gamble on it too. Oh. You could like have whole <laughs> betting pools. <laughs> Which one's I... going to survive the longest? <laughs> I really don't think that. There's a lot. Sometimes some of these people, though, and my first impression of her, I could be wrong, is I don't think she's mentally unstable. I think she's just she's just an a hole. So, but I could be wrong. I know there's some that are like legit need help, but people yeah. like that that I don't think are. And if I'm proven wrong, whatever. But if not, just send them to Snake Island. I the mean, movie I has been done. Marathon Man. <laughs> no, it's a. Uh... We should go back and do the the Arnold movie. I Running, mean, I, what's it called? It wasn't called My, Marathon Man. It was called Running Man. Yeah, a different one. That's a different yeah, movie all together. Yeah, the one with uh, Jesse Ventura and uh, Sven Ove Torsen and uh, all the hits. Yeah. All the hits. All the hits. <laughs> I am. It was back, movies had absolutely no semblance of a plot. You had the best ninety minutes in a week, for lots of boobs, and and, and you uh, you had at least two pairs of boobs shown in a movie. That's how they made action movies in the nineties. It was the bestest of times. I love eighties and nineties movies. They're like my favorite. Yeah, but now we have to sit and, and watch two four and a half hours of of people. Modern movies are like. <laughs> Where do you go? <laughs> oh, you were in this room. Well, <laughs> <laughs> yes, real boobs, real. <laughs> oh man, I can't believe he just came into the room when I was in here. He knocked first, but he he just came in. Oh jeez. <laughs> you, you're, oh. still in the you're still in the room what? <laughs> <laughs> yes I, i'm just sitting here thinking oh gosh <laughs> what are doing? this is what we're doing now oh. <laughs> no i want peace peace on earth and i will show you how to get it you have vengeance. <laughs> to the vengeance. <laughs> that was the latest, latest Michael Bay movie. Speed it up, put on some lens fair, and, and make it four hours long. And hey, scene. I scene. love a good Michael Bay movie. Stop it. <laughs> oh, oh, that was hey, good. Tammy. Boo. Bad Boys is one of my favorites. It's Tim Bernard. No, it's cool. Two A's I mean, the Michael Bay is... Transformers weren't good movies, but they were fun to watch. Yeah, I loved them. I it? loved them. <laughs> I loved them as much as I loved. Well, I loved all the three of them, and then after that, they got really bad. But in in They're Danish, like... two two A's next to each other is an O. So oh. this will it will be pronounced call, and that means farm. Mm. Fun, so, farm means fun, F farm, F fam. No, farm. Tammy Boko go would be Tammy Boo Farm. Boo Farm, I don't know if she's Danish, I'm just making stuff up. But welcome oh, I, to the first <laughs> I'm just making show. stuff up. <laughs> <laughs> Here is in the right, right in the head. <laughs> go on, go on. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, that was too good. Oh, my goodness. So, I need so that what, you, what? It's always this. What? Well, they haven't been no, watching it, all. it is always <laughs> this weird. <laughs> Why? Yeah. What? Huh? It's, uh, it's, it's, it's always the, the same. It's <laughs> all the co caffeine that's uh, kicking in. Did I say the 90s were the breastest of times? Yeah. Yes. Pamela they Anderson. Really were. I, I present you Pamela Anderson. That's why every kid who grew up in the 90s was a front part enthusiast, not a back part, as uh, the kids when the 2000s are. You know, the, good, the, the, the best thing was is meeting Tam Pamela Anderson, uh, how disappointing she was. I was like, oh, I, I don't feel so bad now. Hmm. No, Stacy, you came in. It's the same all the way through. I'm running on four, five hours sleep. You slept? I haven't slept since 5 p.m. yesterday. <laughs> well, that's, that's good. Maybe. <laughs> See, that's what I said, Bugard. That's what I said. Yeah, but I'm just saying if it was Danish, and this is a Danish channel, Danish Christian channel. Oh, so. that's right. Uh, see. So what would mine be if it was Danish? She's a wisnut. <laughs> There's none of none of your letters change. Jamie would be Jamie, Jamie, Jamie. Jamie. Yeah, because what, the, the J, J isn't a hard sound. It's a yeah. That's the same when you uh, with Maya. Ah, you could yummy. make it. You could make it yummy. Yummy. <laughs> yeah. Yummy. So you would be yummy. Jamie is yummy. Yeah, Miami. it's kind of like when we Miami, say Miami. 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 <laughs> Miami is uh, Miami. It's not Miami. Yeah, Miami. Miami, Miami Spice. Yeah. You're crazy. She was hot, uh, but. Uh, well, only whenever she put, only whenever she put all her makeup on and and then they airbrush everything out. Yeah, she's absolutely gorgeous. But in. We'll have to see. Oh, up, 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 encore. <laughs> Maya, <laughs> good to see you. Sabrina, Samantha Fox, yeah. Uh. <laughs> oh, look at that. Everybody's going yummy on you, Jamie. Mm. <laughs> Everybody's going yummy, Jamie. Yummy, Jamie. <laughs> It's my homie. <laughs> Yikes. What happened with the... the I don't know skirt what now. everybody keeps doing. <laughs> such a dork. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. I hope he comes that back with like a poster of Pamela Anderson or something like that. Oh, Does he will. He have yeah. Uh... Welcome back. Oh, oh, only the two Danish people uh, in chat might get oh, this no. one. <laughs> I don't get it. I don't know. Do you know the song Boys, Boys, Boys? Yeah. Her name is Sabrina. And uh, we have a, a Danish DJ who kind of only plays 80s numbers. Mm -hmm. So this shirt is saying, what did you say? Did you say sa? Did you say free? Did you say na? Sabrina with boys, boys, boys. Uh, and then he says, uh, she's the only woman who would give you an instant tit shock. What? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Oh, no. Oh. Yeah, because they're big. Okay. I know girls on film. You're so cute. Girl song yeah. films. That's a good one. <laughs> yeah. No, but uh, he he uh, he used to do some commercials back when mobiles was just coming out, and he played this. Uh, you know that classic. Uh, uh, I don't know if you had like when you had a local dance, you had some stupid DJ who all, always thought he was a little too good, and always. Uh, Oh yeah, yeah over he, the top. 
he was always yeah. over the top, but you were just like, okay, we're just this is like watching a train wreck. Yeah, and then he's uh he's all he was always clad in 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 nineties yuppie clothes, eighty uh, eighties yuppie clothes. These are eighties the yuppie clothes, right? Yeah, no, hmm. that's nineties. That's uh well, Salt Damn and it. Pepper did uh, some uh, shows in in overalls. Yeah, well, these these are overalls that are shorts, you know, like jean shorts. Hey, okay. mad Englishman! No, I said jean a, 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 a tit tit shock. We just uh, we're talking Sabrina and her songs. I I, I think ninety five percent of all the videos I've seen, she have a nip slip. It's yeah. Italian. It's different. Baker, I have a question about that that giant board behind you. So, do you change that thing out every every so often? No, I pull pull off the things and keep them in my little appreciation oh. baggies. Okay. No, oh. I was just curious because those things, I would think by now those things would be filled to the brim. Like, yeah, well, so, so, some of them it moves a little slower, but I I don't I don't grift because. I have uh, no. I wasn't. I wasn't talking about grifting. I was just curious because I've seen them up there, and I'm like, how how does he how, how does he store them? But now I know you you store you you. Yeah, I put I put them okay. back back when I had it on the other wall. I I had them hanging around it, but I'm uh, looking to see if I can find some some nice way to to store them somewhere. So I remember how good people are to me, just like Legally Live, oh. who gifted ten memberships to Mad Englishman. Just turned in, got one. Tammy nice. Brogard, Sean Boyd, American Dreamer, Lynn Dalton, Blue Hat Bible Lady, Nikki K. Mm -hmm. uh, Sweet Tooth Fairy, haven't seen her in a while. Paige M and Crystal Raid and Debbie V. Thank you so much, Legally Live. Awesome. That's, Thank you. That's one of those. So, How are you doing, so T-Bone? So, Baker, do you reset the board like every month or just when it gets a little filled up? When it's when it's in in the beginning, I thought, well, I'll do it, but that was when I had one board, and I didn't know uh, how good days could be some days. So uh, mm. no, now uh, you can see the greens are greens and yellows need to be cleared up. Okay. Thank Aww. you. For doing that. Nice. Go to Kia and buy more posters, yeah, bum. Well, the problem <laughs> is, I can. I can buy uh, these uh, multicolored, but I, I I get as many blue and greens as I get pink and red, and blue and greens works. That's why I had to go with the whites. And I can't. I have tried to look online. I can't. Uh, I can't order them from anywhere. So it's a little stupid. Hmm. You're like yeah, a wishing boy. well. You're like a wishing well. Just Captain Kern gifted five memberships to Monica C. Nice. Denise sells. What does does she sell? <laughs> she lie. She'll she lion. Oh two. Uh, Ken Kane. <laughs> Yorkie mom. Thank you so much for the Cinco membershipo. Oh, I forgot about Cinco Stars. You haven't said it in a long time. No. Good morning, I, 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 I said it on this stream, but you're not listening, so. Oh, yeah. I'm not watching the stream. That's right. No. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> well, I uh, I pronounced it correctly. People might have lived an entire life thought thinking they had another name. Mm. Mm. Ikea, well, uh, Ikea doesn't sell uh, post-its. I have a, it's called Book and Idea, which is a great name. Uh, but they don't sell because I asked if I could just order a, a ton of greens and blues. But they say, nope, they don't do that. That's what the store is called? Book it? That's Book what I was going to say. Idea. Book and Idea? Oh, yeah. that's <laughs> Well, you can't just call up and order like a, a thousand blue post-it notes. Yeah. Well, I, I probably could, but I, I haven't found a, a place. Then, then I have to get to some office supplier who, if I if I get a, a business number, I might. What is a Baker membership run these days? De 
et quatre. The muffin tops are two bucks and cream pies is a four dollar. Yeah. Cinco stars. Here we are. It's T-Rex. <laughs> Again, he's bored with our conversation, so try oh. to switch it up. <laughs> Loretta Baumet. Oh, I just want to hear you pronounce some more names. Well, and, and have you have you gifted out your memberships this month? I can't. I'm a brand account. Ah, uh, you're JKS Watchdog, Jason Raspante, Rosie Smith, Mitt, Mitt. Yeah. Do, do, so you, do. Can, you can't you can't even gift on other people's accounts, can you? Yeah, I'm. I'm. Uh, no, uh, I can't give away my free accounts, and I can't gift accounts, and I can't receive accounts. Yeah, MG has the same problem. Yeah, but it's because I have my yeah. my normal one, and I can't turn this one into a normal one without losing everything. I'm gonna walk back there. Yeah. We don't have Amazon in Denmark. That's why I um, created the T Rex trucking account. It isn't the original username I had on YouTube since I was in high school, but. The whole branded account thing was attached to that, so I created the T Rex Trucking and More account. What is a branded account anyway? Is it- I can't figure out what it is. It's it's just mostly, something. It just mostly manages other channels, like it can be in control of other channels more yeah, than but, one but, channel. But uh, Susie can give me access to his channel, and I can run it. Mm-hmm. So, what? How do you live? Well. I go to shop. I actually, I'm yeah. one. I'm one. This uh, machine, all of you so kindly gave me for my birthday. I could have ordered it online, but I like to go to the local store and buy it at the store to uh, support because I'm not one of those uh, tinfoil hat people. But uh, the more you buy uh, on Sheen and Wish, mm. the more money Xi Jinping has, and the less money the Americans do have so. If it weren't for Amazon, Jamie would have to leave her driveway more often. Yeah, Air Sheen. I love Sheen. Not <laughs> yeah. bad, not bad. <laughs> you, well, yeah, especially when you need something like tomorrow. <laughs> Get on Amazon. But you can just go out to the store and, and buy it. Mm. And then you make sure that your neighbor has a job. That's capitalism, people. From a socialist. My neighbor's doing just <laughs> from a socialist. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. oh. I, I mean, you're not wrong, legendary. <laughs> true. It's very much true. Exactly, Danny T. The, you can you also know, send delivery gifts drivers keep from Amazon. Sending. I like that feature. But uh, Jamie, it's about that time. Do you know what time it is? No. What time is it, Jamie? I told you yesterday. I don't wanna. You don't wanna uh-huh. what? Uh oh. Uh oh. That sounds like a threat. <laughs> <laughs> Fine. What time is it? It's party time. No. It's time. It's time. <laughs> it's better <been a> time. <laughs> what? <laughs> Jesus Christ. What am I going to do with you? <laughs> At least know the wrestling references. You said... Uh, I know all the rest is from the 80s and the 90s. No, I was never. Never said that. <laughs> I she said, said, that. No, she said she knows the she said she knows I, the wrestlers. She doesn't know wrestling. Look, oh, I know names, wow. but I was only part of that small window. Remember, we talked about this. Yeah, but I, I, don't I really liked it. Yeah, you don't listen to me either. So true, see, true. it's mutual. Feelings mutual. Why do we stream together? Why like do we even old try to talk, have conversations? <laughs> yeah, I know they are. It's adorable. <laughs> I, do. I, feel, I feel like I'm talking to a wall half the time, but that's fine. I like the wall. 
Jamie, uh, do you know what time it is? It's time to say goodbye. Oh. What did I tell you yesterday? No, you I don't. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. <laughs> no, I don't, actually. I, is this really something? Because I don't remember. <laughs> you don't remember the entrance of uh, Big Van Vader? It was, it's time, it's time, it's Vader time. And one time in WCW, yeah, that, that big bull mask that could shoot out uh, smoke that weighed so much that uh, he had it once. <laughs> so uh, I think they they spent like 20000 on it and uh, never used it again. Yeah, and WrestleMania starts tonight. <laughs> I was... WrestleMania does start tonight. <laughs> Who was inducted into the Hall of Fame yesterday? Oh, Someone said that uh, I have to figure out that Amazon because more people have said it. But I have a wish list on my <sighs> buy me a coffee, but it's running dry because people are way too, si uh, too nice to me. I think if you are a mod, you can post a link. <laughs> what time is it, Baker? I'm not going to do it. <laughs> Mm. I, I'm I'm sitting here and thinking, why isn't Flux live? Oh, okay. isn't, isn't the guy that uh, was the wrestler Kane? Isn't he like a congressman or something like that? No, he's the mayor of Knoxville. Uh, That's what I heard. Uh, expert like is going to take me and Valhalla to meet him. That would be awesome. They are best friends. For real? For real? Though? Yeah, for real. For real. Well, I don't know. I just make up stories, and uh, then I get mad if it's not true. That's what I mean. sometimes, sometimes you tell me a story and then i'll i'll be re real into it and then you'll tell me it's a lie and then i'm sad so. it's not a lie it's just <laughs> not the truth <laughs> okay sometimes whatever helps you sleep story. at night whatever. Some, sometimes you, that's just called storytelling well, usually, usually it's the okay. benadryl that helps him sleep at night just yeah. keep, keep those pudding yeah. pops on speed dial. <laughs> yep. Flux isn't building any bridge here, Brandon. You better get on to her. <laughs> Apparently, Amazon mm -hmm. Germany is better than Amazon US and UK for shipping to Denmark. Uh, if you ship from the US or the UK, I have to pay import tax on, on it. So that's why uh, if I use an Amazon, it's uh, Germany, and I never used it. But Instead of uh, talking about uh, things Jamie clearly knows nothing about, the greatest wrestlers of the old uh, olden days. I'll brush up do you on know, it uh, just so you feel better. Do you know who uh, Isaac Yankum is? Nope. No. That's Vince McMahon's personal uh, dental assistant. Oh. Oh. It was a short-lived gimmick. He returned as Kane later. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Brandon. <laughs> uh, nope, not pulling that oh one up. God. Oh. <laughs> well, is anyone else gonna go YouTube? No, just YouTube. Shizzy, shell, shill. Shill, shill. Shil. Well, let's see. Oh, you Lord. can you can catch me throughout the week every Monday through Friday. In the morning, 6.30 until uh, about 8.30, something like that. So I, I, I try to keep it try to keep it around two hours. And then uh, you can catch me usually in the evenings. I'll start up about 7.30 and go until uh, I dump everybody over to MG's. And then, then uh, on uh, the Friday... Or the cows come home, and then of course there's uh, there's always there's always Friday Night Live, which you know sometimes I'm not there, but but whenever I am, it's it's always a good time. Actually, it's a good time all the time. Um, and then uh, Sundays I usually do a uh, AI um, reading, so the story is written sometime in the week, which I have to do sometime today. Uh, yeah, we do a AI story. The chat writes the story, and uh, we read it, and it ends up being you know probably about a two-hour show and have dictionary diva we have all storm uh i have a story um we, a couple of weeks ago we had welsh lady reads um she's she's actually in the uh, in in 
she was last I heard she was in the hospital having a drip done because she was dehydrated from being sick. Her daughter reached out to to chat and let him know that that she is she's you know she's getting better, but she's you know having to take a little bit of a break. Um, so prayers for her because she's she's absolute doll. Um, and then we've got uh, uh, who else? Kaiser Pineapple shows up also. Yes, so that that's sort of what our Sunday lineup looks like. Um, whenever and whenever people can't make it, we just we just we just have fun. There you go, chilled. And of course, we give Baker a hard time. Well, howdy there. I'm T Rex Trucking and more. Um, occasionally, I stream um, my drives on my channel, but I haven't been doing that lately. I really, I really do need to get back into it. Um, other than that, I'm usually just in the chat. I'm around, but that's all I got. Oh, thank you, Eris, for dropping the link. Hi. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out with us today. I got nothing to promote. Okay. Do you remember any description as far as the size of these men? Yeah, I remember the size of them. I know I could tell by the swager who the who that one was, you know, by meeting him different times up there at Paula's. I knew the swager is Get that word right, Swayzer. Uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what that word means, so I'm sorry. Oh, his style, his <laughs> oh, so walk, his talk. Okay. His, uh... Yeah, that's uh, everything. Your two <laughs> hours start uh, to the Saturday. We normally ship you over to Flux, but uh, apparently she has a real life. Thank you all, all right, so much uh, for the gifted memberships, the super chats. And the views, please uh, click it, click the lick it, lick on the way out. I'm just eight away from a hundred. That would be nice to hit a hundred before I go out. And there's 107 people watching, so it should be possible. Other than that, show love where love is needed. If you want to be one of those uh, guest uh, angels, go into my Discord, Angels in Waiting or Waiting for Wings. Say, say I can do it better than you can. Most people can. So uh, you can uh, be a, an angel and uh, and show me how it's done because when I ever, ever I do a show, I just I feel the need to to say something, and I don't know, but it sounds kind of like this. Yeah, I apologize. <laughs> what exhibit are you referring to? I'm going to make this 100, Your Honor. All right. 100, because it is 100 percent correct. Objection, Your Honor. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we have to go back in a widow case. Did you, whether it's true or not, believe that Mr. Randolph had slept with your wife? I would have cared. <laughs> you wouldn't have cared? No. Did you believe he had slept with your wife? No. Did you believe he slept with your mother in law? Probably did. Probably did. <laughs> Wait a minute, I need this story time. Everybody has. Everybody has. <laughs> Everyone has slept with his mother. <laughs> if I showed you. Oh my God. I'm, I'm having a Jamie moment. <laughs> and, and the way he just said it, he was just like, oh, yeah, everyone did. <laughs> Things what? on YouTube. Mr. Randall, do you? I got the biggest man. You called him chicken shit. That's right, you are chicken shit. 